I was 21 years old and uh, I was managing a video store at the time when there was such a thing. And one of my customers at the store was actually a real estate broker. Okay. And uh, he sponsored me for my license. And, um, you know, it just started from there. They're working with their buyers and sellers in real estate, but they're each running their own individual business. Mm -hmm. They are handling it like a business, treating it like a business, growing it like a business. I wanted to focus on helping them do exactly that mm -hmm. in building those businesses. I can only do that if I have systems in place, because right. if I want to coach, I want to mentor, I want to assist, I can't spend it dealing with creating things. Real estate tools have already been invented. It's mm -hmm. just a matter of which ones you want to use. And when I found HomeSmart, it allowed me to plug into their systems and utilize those systems and focus on what I do best and that's real estate. The key is finding the right systems and the right tools and the right procedures. You know, it's again, you're, you're plugging into it. It needs to work. But plugging into systems that already exist is far more affordable mm -hmm. than outsourcing multiple systems and pulling them together and tailoring them and customizing them mm -hmm. to yourself. Yep. So I would have spent more time designing mm -hmm. systems, customizing systems, and I'd still be working to continue to shop or systems because everything changes over time. So if I'm spending all of that time, I'm not doing what I do best, but on top of that, it's more expensive. While well, the company's been around for 20 years, it's only been franchised for the past 10. Mm. They are open to learning more. They're a growing company too. Mm. So having started now six years now already for us, I was at the beginning phase of that, that growth. Yeah. So I can literally pick up the phone and call the president of HomeSmart and say, we've got something we need to enhance. Can yeah. we talk about it? And she will listen to what I have to say. So, so having a franchise that grows with you and yeah. wants you to grow with them is, is powerful. So you find that, at least in the real estate realm, we're talking franchises in general, but yeah. in the real estate realm, we find that there's crossover between agents who are looking to partner with the right broker, but that they want to be with a broker that isn't necessarily in that area mm. or what have you. And, and the brokers, while supportive of each other, also need to protect their businesses. Right. You know, and, and I respect that. That's, that's not an issue when it comes to territories and, and growth, but it also becomes an issue when someone in a franchise doesn't have the same reputation that you want to be associated with. And the guy in North Smithfield does something under the same name as the Warwick office, right. and the consumer doesn't know any better to think, oh, right. they're separate. Right. They're right. So yes. you're, they don't you're, look at it that you're, way. You're spot on. Because with that. When, when somebody does something great, people tell a couple of people, right? Yep. When they do something not so great, they tell Facebook. Yep. So. <laughs>